So, you know, I was very pleased with our performance um, in the Super Bowl. Um, I really think that we played as good of a team as we had played all season, um, which is what it should be like when you get to Gillette. You know, you, I don't think that was the case in every game that was played that day, but I think we really truly played as good of a football team as we played all season. Um, and it really took our best effort. Um, you know, I've had a chance to kind of watch the film a few times and um, I'm really, really proud of how our kids competed. You know, Marblehead was a really tough opponent. We um, had to prepare for quite a few different things that they do, especially offensively. Um, and we kind of took their base stuff away and we forced them to kind of get into um, you know, some things that they hadn't necessarily been doing all year. Um, that's kind of been our MO, too. You know, we've got teams out of their comfort zone. Um, you know, nobody's been able to run the ball on us all year, and that was the case again at Gillette. Um, and we kind of made them one-dimensional. Well, during the game, we had, like, it was just, like, physical, and, like, our whole front line, like, they didn't stop pushing throughout the whole game. They gave it 100. Um, our QB, Nick, did a hell of a job throwing the ball, pitching the ball, handing the ball off, and having his reads. Um, our defense had a great game. We held them to like uh, a little over 60 yards in the, until the third quarter. Um, we just had an overall good game. We came out firing and everyone was pumped up throughout the whole game. Uh, you know, I mean, it's the chemistry. You know, we've, I've been playing with these guys for, you know, four plus years now. And, you know, I've known a lot of them since childhood. And it's just, um, it, it makes it easy. It makes it easy to come play with them every day. Um, feels amazing. Uh, it's just like, coming up since uh, either eighth grade to senior year it's just like an amazing feeling you know like we've worked so hard since that and we always knew that we could accomplish this and you know we came out and did what we said. I look at that first Sharon game that I coached uh, in my first season when these kids were sophomores and you're watching them at Gillette Stadium and it's a lot of the same kids but you know we look a lot different you know we're, we're bigger we're stronger we're tougher we're faster we're smarter and we're just playing the game at a, at a much higher level. So, uh, you know, it, it took a lot of work. Uh, these kids put a lot of time in. I think they really care about football. Uh, you know, I, it, it, with these guys, it, you know, they, they had a goal that they were gonna get there. We never really talked about it, but I, I, I know that they did, you know. Um, we never talked about it as group. We just talked about the opponent we were playing that week. But, you know, these kids, kids wanted to get there and they, Accomplish what they set out to accomplish, and that's not easy to do. So. And now, at this time, MIA Associate Director Richard Pearson will present the Division 2A State Championship Trophy.